Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh and good afternoon ladies and gentlemen My name is Mutiara Nabila Purnamasani and I am here as a delegation of Universitas Pendidikan Muhammadiyah Uni Muda Sorong I am here standing as an opening opposition I would like to uh, I would like to um, express uh, my speech about the motion the household ban all production and consumption of meat First of all, I am here as an opening opposition. Uh, I am standing in uh, I am standing in the status quo that I have to uh, that we are actually care about the stability of ecosystem. And this is the things that the opening government doesn't really say about that. We think that ban all the production and consumption of meat is not the right solution of the things that we have to face facing in this time so uh, why I said so the government bench have been standing in their arguments and I have some rebuttal and the reason why is their reason is still uh, uh, their reason or their argument is still debatable or still can be questioned and first of all they are not really defining what is the meat itself what it what is the meat that uh, we are actually consumed that we have been consumed all the day itself they are just telling you uh, guys about the uh, uh, that was uh, consumption meat is uh, hurting the animals and hurting the animals is same like hurting the peoples etc etc but first of all uh, i am here as an opening opposition i would like to uh, give you an explanation about the meat that we are actually consume and the production of meat uh, itself. Uh, meat that often we consume is mostly from the herbivore animals, just like uh, example, just like the cow or maybe just like the goat or maybe the animals that has uh, that has been farming itself, just like the chicken itself. And you know that it. It will. I want to rebuttal the first arguments about the uh, from the opening government said that uh, you know that um, kill, that eating uh, uh, consume the animal is immoral because uh, kills because they said that we kill animals without their choice. But you know, guys, you guys don't really. Uh, you guys uh, prof, you guys provide a solution from uh, for the bis, for the uh, animal farming business about uh, to to change uh, to change their business into the other business uh, and and you say that about the plant based business but you but uh, i think but we as an opposition bench um, really say that that that's not the right things that uh, that all the business can do because uh, you know that not all the states not all the business is in the states or is in the country that can provide them to build, um, you know, a plant based business itself. And you know, guys, um, and uh, it is uh, connected to my uh, secondly arguments that it can make an instability of ecosystem. You know, guys, by then all the production and consumption of meat itself, it's giving the instability of ecosystem itself. You know, guys, most of the uh, if we are stay we are uh, just leaving the animals into the jungle, maybe the jungle life itself. Uh, the the animals it it can be uh, it can be two sides. They can be a predator or they can be a prey. And you know, guys, if we are uh, and um, this kind of animal that mostly been prey is the herbivore animals. It means like if we are not consume the uh, we are not really uh, we are a stop the consumption of meat from the herbivore itself. It can make their population is uh, you know increasing, and you know uh, you know it can make the uh, a predator itself is not really. Uh, it's not really. Uh, I think that it can make the ecosystem is. Uh, it it can ruin the ecosystem itself. And the herbivore actually can make harm about the your farming, your plant based a lot of a lot of things that because they are herbivore, they are eating a lot of grass, eating a lot of leaves itself. So if we are, uh, if they are, uh, uh, you know, a lot of them, a lot of prey, a, a lot of herbivore animals, you know that it can make 
back from the uh, from the ecosystem itself. I mean, from the uh, production production from the uh, you know the plant itself, plant surround us itself. And secondly, you guys uh, already said about the kill as kills animals uh, is same like uh, kills human, and we are not uh, we are uh, not 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 we are shouldn't do that. And my uh, I want to rebut it because not all animal can be consumed and you guys really think that uh, regulated is not really uh, it's, it's hard to lo lobby the regulation to uh, you know protect the animal itself but but i actually realized that the regulation is actually uh, have has been has been protected uh, an animal that should have been protected just like and a rare animals, we cannot, we cannot consume it. We cannot just like take it at our home, uh, etc., etc. We have to uh, the the things that we can just consume is the uh, the farming animals itself. They can, we cannot consume uh, our pet also just like uh, uh, cats or maybe uh, our dogs itself. We can we can, uh, the regulation uh, already uh, you know that they are already. Um, uh, protect it. So, um, and you guys said about the nutrition, nutrition uh, that can gain that gain from the from the uh, animals can be changed or can be substituted by other by other uh, other by other uh, by other um, maybe like by plant based or maybe like from all the things that except the animal itself. But you guys. Uh, uh, already, you guys don't don't really understand about the uh, what is consumed uh, in meat. What is people is really uh, consume meat itself is because meat is actually gain a lot of protein and uh, and there are no reason, no proof that can prove the that the uh, you know meat is making uh, is having a condi uh, is having a conditions just like. Uh, cardiovascular disease or maybe a diabetes itself. So I think that's uh, by ban operation consumption is made is not really the right things to do. Maybe that's all for me. Thank you.